Why Stephen was against the idea of God. Now, that's a question that has been asked by countless people, even in today's century. Because when it comes to science, not every scientist thinks the same. Some believe that the more you understand the universe, the closer you get to believing in a higher power. While others, like Stephen Hawking, found reasons within the universe itself to reject that idea completely. Stephen Hawking wasn't just any scientist. He was one of the greatest theoretical physicists of our time. The man who explored the deepest secrets of black holes, time, and the beginning of the universe. But when people asked him if he believed in God, his answer was always very clear, no. According to Hawking, the universe doesn't need a creator. In his famous book, The Grand Design, he wrote that the laws of physics, like gravity, are enough to explain how the universe can create itself from nothing. He said, because there is a law such as gravity, the universe can and will create itself from nothing. In simple words, Hawking believed that asking who created the universe is a wrong question, because the universe, according to him, doesn't need anyone to create it in the first place. But there's another side to this story. The woman he loved, Jane Wilde, was deeply religious. And even though Stephen didn't believe in God, he never had a problem with Jane's faith. Jane, on the other hand, accepted Stephen for who he was, a man who searched for truth not through religion, but through equations and theories. Their relationship proves something powerful, that faith and science don't always have to clash. Sometimes they can exist side by side through respect and understanding. Still, Stephen's belief, or rather his disbelief, came from logic, not emotion. He said that before the laws of physics, there was no time, and without time, there could be no creator. For him, everything that exists, stars, galaxies, even life itself, can be explained through scientific principles. He believed that saying God did it was an end to curiosity, and that curiosity is exactly what pushes humanity forward. But that doesn't mean he hated religion. He once said that he understood why people turned to God, especially when faced with the unknown. He simply chose science as his way of finding answers, and believed that someday, science would uncover everything that once seemed like a miracle. 